One, two, three, four. There's nothing left in this whole town. Pick up your life and move it around. What is here for me in Tennessee? Pick up your rifle and make a stand. You always said I should be like that guy. But guess what? I'm telling you, I'm not that guy. I'm not Jackson, and my life sucks in particular. Life sucks, and my life sucks in particular. Ten little Indians standing in a line. One got executed, then there were nine. Nine little Indians haven't long to wait. One got syphilis, and then there were eight. Eight little Indians trying to get to heaven. One found Jesus, and then there were seven. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Four little Indians entering a plea. One has a case dismissed, and then there were three. Inside those trees, great father. Good black fox. A few of them held out for more, but they came around. Now, my friend, you and your people can expect a large gift. And protection? Yeah, of course. Continued protection from the United States government. Thank you, great father. One little Indian, nothing to be done. He went and hanged himself, and then there were none. What is that, sir? An orphan? I want him sent to the hermitage to be housed, clothed, and nursed. Give Rachel my condolences for abandoning my promise to never fight again, and that this small souvenir from battle may perhaps give some small consolation to her. But, sir, isn't that just a no good? He may have been given to me for some divine purpose. When I reflect on the fact that his family is dead, much like mine own, I... President Monroe requires your presence in Washington to discuss urgent matters. Who are you? I'm Martin Van Buren, the prematurely obese senator from New York. <laughs> you seem like a kind man. I see in your eyes pain, compassion, and a man who has known no end to suffering. I gotta go. <laughs> All you educated people, you can talk of liberty, but do you really want the American? running their own country. You can't compromise all you want. There's still drunk and smell I pee. Do you really want America run by a man from Tennessee? Joe Quincy Adams. The people are stupid. Henry Clay. They can all go rot. Jackson is a loser. Jackson. to inquire of your dueling and fighting, which we understand to be a prolific it. Oh, yes, tut tut, Broham, make all the accusations you want, because you're not going to steal another election from me. And what about the bigamy? 
The bigamy. The bigamy. Andrew. Well, what about it? Well, I'm sure you're aware that there are rumors that circulated from Tennessee up to New England that you married your wife, Rachel, while she was still wet to another man. Say something. Th that slander of the basest order. A Mr. Lewis Roberts? Shut your mouth, you weasel wearing ass. I mean, I think it's a real tragedy that Jackson moved all the Indians from here in Florida. Me too, a real tragedy. And that's why we hesitated to move here. Absolutely. I mean, we didn't want it to seem like we were endorsing that kind of behavior. No, no, of course not. But then we were like, it is nice that it doesn't snow. Yes, it is. So like, uh, it's really great that he did that but we definitely don't condone it.